Hey, hi, hello there. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to install the Dragonblock Apollo server mod. Now I had a video on this previously, but it seems like the website doesn't seem to work anymore. So if you go to the, the link that I sent, uh, you get something like this, which is not gonna work. So what you wanna do is you wanna go to Google and we're gonna install the Technic Launcher. This is the easiest way to do it. So just go to the first link here, the Technic Platform Launcher, and you just wanna go down, let's see, you wanna go down here to get the launcher, visit the download page. So just click this button right here. Uh, another way of doing this would be get the launcher right up here, click that. And then you might get some tricky ads like this, but just ignore that. Come all the way down here to pick your platform. So you're gonna pick Windows, Mac, or Linux. Most likely you have Windows or Mac and just click the platform. So I'm gonna click Windows right here. And then you'll see down in your browser, you have installed it. Okay, so I'm just gonna go to show in folder or go to your downloads folder. In your downloads folder, you'll get something like this. Double click it. And once you double click it, you'll get something like this. And then it just asks you to log in. So I'm gonna you know, log in for my Microsoft. Once you log in, you get something like this. You can see I'm logged in down here as Wally Moto. Uh, and then all you need to do is just go to mod packs. Okay. And then you can search the mod pack you want. In our case, it's Dragon Block Apollo. So you see you got Dragon Block Apollo. There's also a bunch of other Dragon Block stuff if you're interested in that. So I'm gonna click this. Okay. And then all you need to do is just come down here and click install and just wait a little bit. All right, so what this did is it installed the packages and installed Minecraft for the correct version and Forge and all that. So if you come up here, this this isn't anything to, to play with the game. I just want to show you what's happening uh, within the Technic Launcher. Uh, you'll see that there's mod packs. In this case, Technic Launcher mod packs. Here is basically like a, a mini Minecraft folder. You see you have mods, config, and all that stuff you're used to saves. So um, that's where all that is being saved. So it's the same thing as what we did before, but it's automatically happening. And all you need to do is not worry about any of that, just click play. So once it runs, you'll see a page like this, which is an official Dragon Block Apollo uh, Minecraft mod server here. And all you need to do is just click official server. There are some uh, uh, additional buttons like going to the website, uh, Discord, which again, the website I think is turned off, so don't worry about that. You got all the mods. Uh, all you have to do is just uh, click official server. And just like that, you are in the game. Okay, so uh, if you've never played the game before, you just kind of come in here. Whoops. There should be an area that explains to you. Yeah, right here. So it says stop here. Um, okay, so this is US3. We don't want any of that stuff. You don't even have to do any of that. You can just go forward slash. And then uh, I think you just type, yeah, it says right at the bottom, US1 uh, is probably the most popular. So just click that. And there you go. Uh, let me just see. I think I'm, yep, my same character. It's saved. And you're good to go. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Um, and if you need to modify anything, it's going to be uh, all done through the Technic Launcher. Uh, no need to install the thing manually. It's super, super easy. I highly recommend this. My old video at this point is uh, old and I probably wouldn't go down that method because it's very manual and uh, labor intensive. Okay, uh, hope you learned a thing or two. Be sure to like and subscribe if you found this to be useful. See you in the next video.